Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into the world of online entertainment and taking a closer look at a platform called Froost.com. It's a membership-based platform that promises access to a massive library of digital content. They claim to have everything from the latest blockbusters to classic films, all kinds of music, audiobooks, and even games and software. Sounds pretty amazing, right? But before you jump in and sign up, there are some things you need to know. First, there have been numerous reports of users being tricked into signing up for subscriptions they didn't want. They'll be offered a free trial, but then they'll find themselves getting charged unexpectedly when they try to cancel. Second, there are also complaints about unexpected charges and poor customer service. People have reported being charged for services they never signed up for, and when they try to reach customer service for help, they either can't get through or don't receive any assistance. On top of that, some users have mentioned having trouble logging into their accounts, which makes it even harder to cancel subscriptions or manage their accounts. Additionally, there seems to be very little information available about the ownership and location of the platform. And finally, if you take a look at Froost.com's reviews on Trustpilot, you'll see a lot of negativity. People are sharing their experiences with difficulty canceling subscriptions, getting refunds, and dealing with what they believe are deceptive practices. This overwhelming negativity is a strong indication that there may be something wrong with this platform. Based on all of this information, it's strongly recommended to exercise extreme caution before even considering using Froost. Instead of taking the risk with Froost.com, there are many other safe and reputable platforms out there that offer similar content libraries. What do you guys think? Have you ever heard of Froost.com? Share your thoughts and experiences in the comments below. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more honest reviews and tech discussions.